Hi everyone, I'm meteorologist Sam Ryan. While we look back at the temperatures as this heat wave unfolded and we saw them rising into the 90s and middle 90s by Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday here. The warmest I saw was 92, it was a little bit earlier in the day. And then we've uh, been able to see some cloud cover helping to cool us off just a touch. And we also have some smoky skies. So all that is leading to slightly cooler temperatures. Now it's still gonna be hot, above average that is, for the day on Monday, but I think we'll top out now in the 80s rather than the 90s. We see a big ridge, high pressure down to our south. This is a radar satellite loop, and embedded within that, small disturbances coming in from the southwest. Uh, we've got, uh, after some daytime heating, triggering off some of these thunderstorms. Now it's still really dry over the southern part of the state. Dew point temperatures in the mid 30s but that will climb into the middle 50s for the day Monday and lead to a better chance at slightly more numerous scattered thunderstorms through the afternoon. And some of those could be on the severe side. So hot temperatures still technically, but not as hot. Better chance of storms as we head through the afternoon Monday. We'll get a few more Tuesday and Wednesday and temperatures kind of cooling off. That ridge flattens a bit, but we'll still have disturbances traveling along that flow coming in off the west. Smoky skies from wildfires in Oregon primarily. So if you're wondering where's that smoke coming from, this is a look at some of the wildfires. These in Oregon have yet to be contained. And so you can go to zoom.earth and see that pretty clearly. That's a website. And uh, this shows the satellite image and it shows some of the uh, wildfire overlays if you click on that. Looking at our chance of severe storms here Monday, a marginal threat to a slight risk. So that's higher confidence as a level two out of five, and that's exclusively for the threat of damaging straight line winds, gusts over 60 miles per hour. We have a marginal threat then, a little farther to the east for the afternoon on Tuesday. Still a general thunderstorm chance for us. Again, dew point temperature, a little more moisture climbing as we head throughout the day here on Monday. And that scattered thunderstorm threat should be out of here as we get close to midnight and a quiet overnight. Mid 60s out the door on our Monday morning. Daytime highs warming up to 87. Average highs 83, so still warm. Casper is cooling down. They hit high of 97. They're at 85 now for the day Monday. Still some mid 90s over towards Scotts Bluff and Torrington. 96 and 94. And they have that slight risk of severe storms. Uh, about a 47, 50% chance of storms, we'll say, through the afternoon. And record highs 100. Sunset at 8.30 p.m. And cooler yet for the day Tuesday. Still a chance at some scattered thunderstorms. General thunderstorm chance here, marginal threat of an isolated severe storm off to our east. We'll hit a high of 83 and 75 on Wednesday. Won't that feel nice?